As you might have seen over the weekend, Elon Musk, billionaire, in fact, the richest person on the planet currently, decided to randomly take a shot at Bernie Sanders. Bernie Sanders oftentimes will talk about the need to tax excessively wealthy people, but I mean, this time, he didn't even name drop Elon Musk. It was fairly innocuous for Bernie Sanders, but yet Elon Musk took issue with it. So Bernie Sanders tweeted out, We must demand that the extremely wealthy pay their fair share, period. Not controversial, right? Well, not if you're Elon Musk, because he responded saying, I keep forgetting that you're still alive. I mean, this is a man who is supposed supposed to be an adult. I believe he's in his 50s, if not his 60s. I might be wrong about that. But this is an adult. And here he is childishly attacking a United States senator for just saying what is common sense if we want to live in a society that's healthy. So this proves that billionaires aren't uniquely intelligent because somebody who responds like this isn't very bright in my opinion, but it also demonstrates how brazen these billionaires are because they know that they can say and do whatever they want and get away with it because in a late stage capitalist society, they hold all the cards. They have all of the power. In this type of a system, wealth equals power. And you saw how the billionaire tax that was proposed just a couple of weeks ago was killed by the Democratic Party's own members. Their party proposed it, and then their own members fought tooth and nail against it. Now, we don't necessarily know if it will pass yet, but if I had to bet, I'd say probably not. Now, immediately, I just want to show you a couple of responses that stood out to me. So, Rob Israel responded saying, this piece of shit cult leader quadrupled his wealth during the pandemic while telling everyone COVID wasn't real. Then he adds, Elon Musk is a tax-dodging, anti-union, crypto-scheme-pushing scuzzball. Well said. Left flank vets responded simply by sharing a meme telling him to shut the fuck up, along with a picture of him and Jeffrey Epstein's alleged accomplice. Simple, yet effective. And that photograph is seen here. Um, so... Basically, to give you some additional context, Elon Musk has always been a douchebag on Twitter, but his douchebaggery is increasing exponentially, and it really started to ramp up when this new uh, so-called billionaire tax was proposed. Now, I say so-called billionaire tax because even if it's a tax on billionaires specifically, they're still billionaires if you tax them. So it's not like they're not going to be billionaires. In fact, this was produced by the Washington Post, and it shows you uh, that if we actually put into law the uh, bill proposed by Democratic Senator from Oregon, Ron Wyden. Elon Musk would lose about $50 billion if his unrealized capital gains were taxed. But odds are, this isn't going to pass, and even if it did, again, he's still going to be a multi-multi-billionaire. He will still be obscenely wealthy. And to just kind of put things into perspective for you, here's a couple of facts that you may or may not already know about billionaires. So this is from BuzzFeed's Natalie Ogensian. So Elon Musk is currently the world's richest billionaire with 300, 6.5 billion to his name. Even if you were to make 100 million per year, it would still take you 3,065 years to amass that level of wealth. Oh, and also he's earning about $11,415 an hour. Imagine if you made that much money. It's inconceivable, right? Well, also throughout the past two decades, American billionaire wealth has increased from $240 billion adjusted for inflation to $4.18 trillion in March of 2021. That's 17 times more than their total wealth in 1990. Now, finally, if you can believe it, there's a huge wealth gap even among billionaires. The majority, 94%, are worth $10 billion or less. After that, 5% are worth between between 10 and 30 billion, while mega billionaires who comprise less than 1% of all billionaires are worth more than $30 billion. And Elon Musk obviously is in the latter category there. So if I were Elon Musk and I knew that there were all of these efforts, uh, both politically and socially, to tax my wealth, I might want to be a little bit quiet, not be too brazen. Uh, but he's just demonstrating why this needs to to happen, why his wealth absolutely needs to be taxed. Because again, when you have this much wealth, you influence policy. You actually pose a threat to democracy, and that's not hyperbole. There was a 2014 study from Princeton University's Dr. Gillens and Page, and they found that when it comes to policy outcomes, what gets passed are the policies that are disproportionately preferred by elites and special interests. But when it comes to average citizens, we have a statistically insignificant impact on policy outcomes. So again, what billionaires want 
they get. There's a reason why we're not seeing an increase in the minimum wage. There's a reason why we don't have Medicare for all. Because in this country, currently, the way that it stands is we're functionally an oligarchy. That's the sad reality. And Elon Musk doesn't even have to do much because there are already swarms of lobbyists who are rallying against this proposed billionaire tax by Ron Wyden. So he doesn't even have to do much. He can keep his mouth shut and continue to accumulate wealth, but he's brazen. He can't help himself. He has to attack Bernie Sanders, one of the best senators in America, one of the only senators actually fighting for real people and say, oh, I can't, uh, I can't believe you're still alive. Or what did he say specifically? Um, I keep forgetting that you're still alive. Imagine that. What a piece of shit. But, um, I mean, this is something that normal people already see with regard to Elon Musk. I mean, he's, he's shown his true colors time and again. And sure, there's going to be nerds that respond to this video uh, defending him for no reason. But understand that if you're defending Elon Musk and billionaires like him, you are a useful idiot. You are a bootlicker. These folks don't care about you. They don't care about the future. They don't care about the planet. They care about their own wealth. So I'll leave that there. Elon Musk attacked Bernie Sanders in the most shameless and childish way yet. This man is a fucking baby. Were you acting like a...